ऑब्जर्वरशिप वर्सेज फेलोशिप इन मेडिकल करियर सो वेलकम यू ऑल टूडे विल डिस्कस ऑन दिस टॉपिक आई एम डॉक्टर संदीप पटेल फाउंडर एंड सीईओ एट डॉक्टम लेट्स स्टार्ट दिस डिस्कशन सो इफ यू आर एम बी बी एस डॉक्टर्स लुकिंग फॉर अ फेलोशिप्स और इफ यू आर अ पोस्ट मेडिक पोस्ट ग्रेजुएट और रेसिडेंट डॉक्टर्स और इफ यू आर अ रिसेंट प्रैक्टिशनर यू हैव जस्ट कंप्लीटेड योर मेडिकल पोस्ट ग्रेजुएशन एंड यू हैव डन वन और टू इयर्स ऑफ प्रैक्टिस एंड नाउ यू यू वॉन्ट टू मूव टूवर्ड्स द सब स्पेशलिटी प्रैक्टिस और यू आर अ मिलेनियल प्रैक्टिशनर completed your 8 to 10 years or 12 years of practice as a generalist and you want to move towards the specialist profile uh, this video is for you so who should do what observership versus fellowship let's start it so observership what is it it's an academic program and wherein fellowship is an uh, training course usually who should do observership so practitioners or professionals who are doing ex, uh, their practice and they are they are uh, cannot spend more time for their training like because uh, if they have a limited time period of one month to three months they do observership in a particular sub specialty and uh, for recent graduates or uh, recent practitioners Uh, they do fellowships because they uh, if they are in a starting initial phase of their career they uh, they can go for 6 months one year of uh, uh, fellowship why sh- you should do observership so observership is for to upgrade your knowledge and skill and fellowship is for adding a qualification to your profile while um, observership it is a voluntary uh, part where the existing practitioner do such thing to uh, upgrade their knowledge only but the fellowship somewhere it is necessary for the career if you want to settle in a tier 1 tier 2 city the fellowship is nowadays it's a necessary and usually observership are 1 to 6 months of duration up to 6 months uh, not more than that but fellowships are 6 uh, months to 2 years of duration of courses now what's the impact of fellowship in your medical practice so definitely it is an additional qualification second it make your profile strong as an expert in that subject third it gives a good clinical exposure fourth patient recognizes your achievement while choosing your service fifth it you will be able to stand extraordinarily among the medical fraternity in terms of knowledge skills your uh, uh, experience etc and sixth help it helps to set your practice in tier 1 and tier 2 city as in tier 1 and tier 2 city the competition in existing industry is is very high and for the fresher for the general uh, medical uh, post graduates it is difficult to set up their practice so if you are carrying a such profile of a fellowship in particular sub specialty it will make your easy path for uh, setting up your practice in a particular city so for if you are looking for such fellowships in your uh, area of interest you can search on doctor courses it has more than 2500 fellowships all over india offered by different hospitals and institutes go and you can just need to search filter and apply to multiple uh, institutes and if you want to know about any fellowships any of the if you have any dilemma uh, while choosing the medical sub specialty you can comment below uh, your suggestions your confusions we will definitely get back to you and will prepare the content for you and uh, stay tuned with doctor for such healthcare career and professional upgrade information thank you thank you very much